doing today? Sun is shining. Thank you, Jesus. I love it when the sun shines. See all the the moisture? Thank God it's on the outside. Um, this is what I'm making for dinner today. I'm making cabbage soup. I've got my cabbage on. I'm going to put this burner on about 9 and let it start cooking. I put just a tiny bit of water in here, just enough to keep it from sticking. Once this starts wilting, wilting down, I'm going to add my ground beef excuse me can't talk straight today i'm going to add my ground beef which i've already browned a little bit got it it's cooked and then i'm going to add my seasoning excuse me i have my dishwater in the sink i always like to wash dishes as i go but i'm going to add the oregano because this is a mixture of ingredients it's thyme oregano marig marijuana, ever how you say that, basil, rosemary, and sage. So I like to add that to any soup I make. I won't need that basil because I have basil in the other one. And then I use sea salt, pepper, and some garlic salt, which I have some fresh garlic I'm going to chop up in it, and some onion. And I will be adding other vegetables. So I will come back in a little while when this cooks a little bit and show you what I add to my cabbage soup okay i'll catch you in just a little bit okay you guys it's time to add some stuff to my cabbage first i want to turn this down to medium okay i already added my seasonings that i told you i was going to put in it i can't tell you how much seasoning to put in yours it's a, it's a taste thing so that you would have to just kind of do yourself um I'm going to add a can of peas and diced carrots, just a 8 ounce, 8.5 ounce can. I'm going to add some corn, about the same amount, and I'm going to add a 14.5 ounce can of tomatoes, and I use the red gold, but you could use any brand. It's just the one that I have on hand. This kind of makes a really good soup. And I will be adding some tomato vegetable juice, about a can full to this. Um, I'm going to pause you while I add my meat. Okay. Now I'm using the same tomato can that I used to put in the tomatoes for my juice. That's all the tomato juice that I'm adding. And then I'm going to add a can of uh, water. And I'm just going to let this simmer. It's going to simmer probably for a good hour. I just like to let it simmer slow to help get all of the flavors together and then I'll decide if I need to add anything else. So I'll be back and show you what it's like when I get to that point. Hey yeah, you guys, this is what the soup looks like once it's all cooked. And it is yummy. Husband already had his supper and said it was really good. This is my bowl. As you see, I don't got a lot. It's kind of late. We're eating late, so I didn't put a lot on my plate. But I'm going to taste it. How y'all so, doing? Um, I hope you guys will try this uh, cabbage soup. It's really good. If you like cabbage, it, it's real good. Okay, I'm going to taste my soup. Mm. Very good. Not bad if I have to say so myself. Yeah, I got my shower, washed my hair, combed it back, and then it was time to have a little bite to eat. 
Yeah, this is good. Okay, you guys, I hope you liked coming along with me and cooking. Don't do that very often, but sometimes it's just fun. And I'm going to get off of here and enjoy my supper. So, you guys have a good evening. Have a good week. God bless each one of you. Welcome to my channel. You'll see a lot of good things on here, I hope. Or at least a lot of stuff. <laughs> and I'll catch you tomorrow in another video. God bless each one. Bye.